Hello everyone and welcome back to EU4 playing as Austria. We are waiting for some spy network on Mulhouse so we can go to war with them. Not because I want to attack Mulhouse but because they're allied to Regensburg. Uh, and in Regensburg there is a center of reformation we want to get rid of. So we'll do that ASAP before more princes join that heretical cause. And once we remove the centers of centers of reformation, it should be a cleanup instead. Statuta Valacorum. The advance of the Ottoman Empire has completely changed the political geography of south southeastern Europe, and many Slavs and Romanians are leaving their old homes to res resettle in the border areas of our empire. Eager to win back their old homes, these people could likely make fierce warriors and guerrilla fierce soldiers and guerrilla warriors. If we are to guarantee their religious and cultural freedoms, the frontier may be a bit unruly, but the populace united in their hate for elements could serve us very well. Hmm. Uh, local missionary strength down for 30 years. Okay, I guess we can wave goodbye to this for a bit. But we could do Bosnia. France. Oh, nice. Good work, France. You should probably take over the throne. Hmm. We need... I need 20? 25. 30. Oof. An incident. The Hansa was once the undisputed master of the trade from London to Novgorod. Now, though the fortunes of the Hanseatic League has fallen into decline, into desperation, the League has petitioned the Emperor for help. Right. What is this? We have no obligation. Uh, I don't really care. So, uh, oh well. Oh well. Uh, Gellera, that's fine. Diplomat. Reputation? We do like reputation. Oh. 13 heretical princes now. Oh well, at least we've got this one here. How did it go with our diet here? Mecklenburg at least a hundred... Oh, we couldn't do that? Oh, close. Let's uh, give them a gift. Of a few coins. Nice, nice. Mm, clergy. We need to, need to get them to 50. I could do... Sell 10. No, is it 60 or 50? I actually forgot. 60. So clergy, I could do that. That's not enough though. Curia power. Yeah, we could do these two. Advisor cost. Hmm. Oh, here. Missionary strength. Enforced unity of. Yes. Plus three, oh, church sanctuaries. Upon destruction of church buildings. I have no plans on destroying church buildings, so let's do that. So, but 10, that's 58, that's not enough. God damn it. <laughs> oh, unless it will go up, oh, it will go up. Equilibrium is 68 points, oh, okay. This, this is falling. Governing capacity, we don't need... Well, we'll go in capacity right now. Prestige. Uh, we do like prestige, but... Uh. 
light ships, that's meh. Don't want to do monopolies either. I guess we can do this. I need one more thing. Well, free enterprise. And then sales. Oh, I thought it was. Mm, okay. Above 30. This should still go up to 60 here, yeah. 69, giggity. Hmm. Oh, we need more crown lens as well, okay. Alright, the the thing, the spine network is almost at 30, so we can start thinking about doing our... Not a fire. A bit too much, but oh well. Doing our war. Mm -hmm. Oh, we have paused. My bad. It's been expense, sure. Let's do this as well. Okay. Claim, come home, and well, wait a few more ticks, I think. Yeah, that heretical prince shenanigans. It's not good. This will end when? Uh, next year... Oh, in a moment. January, I think. Or the 14th of January. Let's wait for that then. After that, go to war. Oh well. I'm getting a few more points here, so that's good. I think once you reach Perpetual Diet... I think you can start branching off into centralization or decentralization. Though, uh, there is a point to be made to try and get to Eviger Landfriede, like eternal peace within the Empire. It uh, certainly brings like a lot of points faster. Though, of course, it's two more things. Then we were, in, then when we were be here, we would actually be finished if we just went directly. But I'm not sure what's faster though. Hmm. Oh well, where are you? Here. Right, Brandenburg, you would not join the Allied. You have a truce. Regensburg. Goslar, Ulm, Rothenburg. It's a lot of small dudes, but... Oh, now you want to join. Let's see if we can't kill some of their armies and maybe let our underlings take care of uh, the sieging. Oh. oh, another one. Good. Alright, we also had an army up here I forgot all about. With a few more troops. Where are you going? Up there? Hmm. Should I keep this navy? Nah. Not right now. Oh! Saxony. Uh, the Pope. Ottoman Stokadir Tunis. Okay. Great peasant war. Oh. No, where is it? Uh, pfft, here. 
has not enacted Peasant Republic. The Great Peasant's War embroils the whole Roman Empire in conflict. While this is going on, rebellion peasants may be emboldened and may even overthrow the government. Oh, okay. Is that an incident? No. Hmm. Okay, go, go, go. Gosla, you are Catholic. Okay. Oh, another sense of information. The reformed are now popping. Ooh. Oof. Uh, not sixty yet. Pretty damn close though. Oh, we're behind on tech here. And here. Nope. Didn't do much. Mm. Oh, we also war with the... Holstein. Oh, okay. You are Catholic, though. you over here so we can reinforce if either of our armies are attacked okay Gosla you are Catholic so just give me coin don't talk to France in any shape or form Okay, Regensburg has been taken. Good. Because... Force religion. And, I don't know, do this. Okay, that's one less sense of reformation. Uh, Pelsnet, you are... Catholic. Right. Switzerland, you are Catholic as well. I don't really care, just give me some coin and that's it. Ulm, are we occupying Ulm? We are. You are also Catholic, so that's fine. Give me money. That's fine, you can be friends. Let's see. Rotherberg, what are you? Catholic as well. Eh, uh, fine. Holstein, you're also Catholic. So, could we just white piece you? We could. Oh, we can even maybe grab something. Nope. Okay, that's fine. Uh, nice, nice. Four and quarter, sure. My old ally. That's fine. What is a re ally you? Okay. Rutherberg. You are already Catholic, so... Go here. Here. And here. You are also Catholic, so that's fine. Is that a sense of reformation? It is. Oh, it's in my 
allies territory. I guess the reformed are also counting as heretical, right? Should we just white piece them? Sure. It's just to get rid of that thing. They're all above 60, right. We could do this the cheapest ones. 27.47. Oh, damn. It'll take a while. Hmm, we could see some land, but that will make them disloyal, so that won't work. Uh, yes, we ally. Alright, let's see here. Uh, the Pope. Oh, the Pope took a bunch of stuff here, right. Do I... Oh, I have no claims. Well, let's get a claim here on Hysteria. They still have Naxos. And uh, Necroponta. And Corfu, okay. Rise up. Oh. Let's help them with that. Hmm. Oh, I had two. Oh, uh, give me access. Take front dead. Uh, sure. No, oh, nah, I wanted access first. Peasants are revolting. Major revolt. Come on. Go. Whack. Turn a blind eye. The oh, crap. Hat second something. Oh, we already had some soldiers standing there. Catholic zealots. Yeah, that's fine. Can do whatever. I couldn't like. Uh, no, we didn't have the CB to it. No, to pull them into the empire. Maybe if they lost all of these things, we could do it with Venice itself, though. They would probably blockade us before we can get out there. Most likely. Hmm. Alright, let's see here. State uh, General. We don't have absolutism yet, so... I guess we could take Aristocratic Court. Uh... Russell. Ah, tick is coming up soon. Twenty-eight point twenty-seven. Hmm. And uh, let's see. You boarded the empire. You're probably too large, right? We could do conquest against you. Uh, hmm. Okay, now we border the Ottomans directly. The meteorite of Enschisheim. On November 7th, 1492, a meteorite weighing 127 kilograms fell in a field outside the town of Enschisheim in Alsace, further Austria. When villagers tried to remove parts of the meteorite, a local magistrate interfered in order to preserve it for Maximilian, the future emperor. He declared to be a wonder of God, and after removing two small pieces for himself, an Archduke Sigismund of Austria, he returned the meteorite to the city to be preserved in the parish church. Wonderful. And uh, anyway, hmm. you, Anhalt. Brunschwick. Could do no CB. Ugh. It's very tempting, get rid of that last Protestant center of reformation. The triumphal procession 
In 1512, Emperor Maximilian commissioned a woodcut print called the Triumphal Pro Procession, which was to reflect magnificence to the Emperor. Be quiet, phone. It was designed to decorate the walls of the city halls and palaces. When Maximilian died in 1519, the woodcut was still unfinished. With more than 130 woodblocks and measuring over 50 meters, it is one of the world's largest prints ever produced. Uh, glory. Yes. Bring me some glory. It is known. Uh, why not? No, we we'll need them. Oof. It doesn't say we'll get any coalition. So I suppose that's correct. Yeah, we have zero with a lot of them. I think it's worth it. Oh, you are Catholic, right? Go. Fifteen three twelve. Hmm. Do that. Oxaroy. Let's just get it. So I wouldn't have to worry about that anymore. Bring balanced estates, rather. Too often the descent and divisions plague plagued our country. The nobility, clergy and burghers must act as one to achieve the aim of greater glory and prosperity for Austria. I agree. Hmm, okay. To boost Austria itself. I should probably also start integrating Milan. I keep talking about it. I also keep forgetting about it. I guess they're sort of nice to have as backup. Mm, too bad it wasn't in some kind of capital, so we could convert it. When will the religious war thing happen? Fifty princes. Sixty-nine member states, okay. <laughs> right. Military tech is really cheap. And let's do here. Manpower is a lot. Damn, 20. <laughs> oh, corruption. Right. Okay, Brunschwick. You are. You've been taken over. Uh, just do that and give me some coin. Sweet. How much are we getting in reparations? Uh, down here. Not a lot. <laughs> but we're getting it from a lot of people, though. Quarantine? Sure. Did we ever get a claim here? We did. Okay, the Ferreira and Salzburg. Hmm. Salzburg, who are you allied to as well? Nuremberg and Memmingen. Uh, okay, the Catholic. They shall have our endorsement. Eh, uh, fine. Go on here. Right. Fourth region. And the Protestant Reformation centers are gone. 
Now we just have this here to contend with. I'm not really sure how we can convert that. I don't think we can. Unless we perhaps inherited Brandenburg and took the province, or yeah, and then converted for them. If we got enough conversion strength. Hmm. Yeah. Interesting. Hysteria. Uh. Fera is they're both already in the Empire. Oh, wrong button, yeah. Mantova. Luca. Still oh good relations. Ew. Don't do that. The truce ends when? Twenty seven. Okay, a long time. Oh, okay, we inherited uh what you might call it? Uh this face. Milan. Uh, a lot of faults as well. Hmm. We could release Palmer. I think I want to do that. It's only 10 prestige. And they're still in the Empire, yeah. Okay, uh, do that. Sweet, I guess. Yeah, sure. Yeah, that's pretty good. We didn't really have to pay for the f pay for them. Uh, what is this institution? So, Emperor France, right? Let's see... Wow, wait, what? Not eligible to be emperor. Oh, right, we have no heir. <laughs> okay. But, let's see, we have an alliance here, here, here and here. Trier, are you, my, are you in an alliance with me? No, you're not. Let's do it. So Milano got Habsburg. Nice. I think you're too large to take on in terms of bringing you into the Empire. The truce here did end, right? The Pope? Hmm. Saxony. Siena is also in the Empire. I think doing this would be quite nice. Let's see, you two combine over here. Go, go, go. Uh, I don't care about France, not really at least. Who are you fighting? Serbia, Parma, and Genoa. Okay. I guess this is a war for Serbia, right? Yeah. That it is. Alright, let's see here. Mm, can you go? No. Go here and here. Uh, grab Albrecht. Sure. Uh huh. Can call in Brandenburg. Sure, why not? 
Oh, we can't do this because it war with the Pope. We could maybe make them release a Beano. We do and take Splato from the Pope. We need to bring them down to size so they can we can force them to join the Empire. Florence is up there. Peasants being annoying. Well, we do need to cut, so yeah, we'll fix the war in the next episode. Thanks for watching. Please leave a like, comment, subscribe, hit that bell button. I very much appreciate your support. And a big extra thanks to my channel members, Mike Murray, Tim Reno, Wiscomet, Jeffrey Henderson, and Christoph Kroll. Thanks again. See you next time.